so hello everyone welcome back to my channel and today i am going to discuss about the hydraulics panel so basically this is a very technical video so in a brief i'll discuss about hydraulic panel and how the system is cost pressurized so without any further delay let's get started so first of all i'll go to the overhead panel and as you can see uh, this is the hydraulics panel so hydraulic panel is there are three systems one that is green system second that is blue system and third that's yellow system so the engine one which is the left engine powers the green hydraulic system through a engine one pump or you can say electrical pump second engine uh, pressurize this yellow hydraulics through engine two pump okay that is the right engine and there is a, another electrical pump uh, which we use on the ground so basically for uh, ground uh, if we have to use the parking brakes when the engines are off so basically parking brakes uh, uses the yolo hydraulics basically yolo hydraulics pressurize the parking brake so when we uh, have to use the parking brake on the ground and the engines are not running so we use this electrical pump to pressurize the hydraulics basically the blue hydraulics itself uh, pressurized by a electrical pump which is basically automatic pump okay and also the rack the ram air turbine so what is the rack the ram air turbine basically a system when the in the ac electrical uh, system i will discuss about the ac panel uh, ac bus basically so here i will just show you uh, one thing that uh, if i'll go to electric so as you can see there are ac bus 1 and ac bus 2 okay and currently it is uh, totally powered by this apu generator so both the engines are off okay so if i will start engine number 2 and engine number 1 so they will just take over uh this ac1 and ac2 so if there is any uh, time on the condition of the flight uh, suppose there is a, a very urgent situation and uh, the ac1 and ac2 bus fails so suppose uh, let's take a scenario of that ki generator 1 and generator 2 the both the engines fails so what will happen basically it will uh, just lose both the ac bus and when the ac bus will lose its electricity then this ram air turbine extends automatically this is the girded uh, switch basically so uh, for uh, any urgent situation also uh, when we use to uh, just uh, switch on the rat or extend the rat okay manually so we just uh, switch uh, unguard this switch and then we open the switch and then we press the push button so that the rat rat can extend so ram air turbine basically powers uh, actually pressurize this blue hydraulic system which actually runs the emergency uh, a uh, generator which uh, gives us 5 kV amperes of electricity so i will discuss it uh, more about in the electrical video okay so this is the three systems okay now i will just switch on the uh, engines so that you can see how the pressure actually works over here so currently i will just uh, switch on the hydraulic panel uh, hydraulic is here So as you can see, both the pressure have both the three system having zero pressure. Okay, now here I will start the engines. So I will put the engine master to ignition. Uh, mode select to ignition and I'll start Starting the engine, engine number two. two. Okay, I'll switch off the checklist basically. Okay. So as you can see, the engines are uh, rising up. okay the agt is rising the actually so you can see this thing the engines have the power so they are pressurizing this yellow hydraulics and the blue hydraulics basically you can see this that catched up quickly okay that catch this uh, pressure quickly 3000 psi 3000 psi basically the uh, engines are having the electrical pump so electrical pump pressurizes this blue hydraulic and the left engine engine 2 is, is stabilized it is now stable so it pressurize the yellow hydraulic and then i will just start the engine number 1 starting number 1 as you can see the pressure is increasing this is the sound of ptu you can see this ptu basically this is connected so what does the ptu does now if uh, the system having a pressure differential of 500 uh, psi so then the either uh, system will pressurize the other one okay one system will pressurize the other one so if the yellow is you can you just saw this thing 
the yellow, yellow was connected with this green system through this PTU. So the pressure differential was 500 psi or more. So that is why the yellow system was trying to uh, pressurize engine one this is stabilized. system. So now the engine one is stabilized. So this is all That's about the hydraulic. That's a good start on both engines. Battle. All systems are normal. Thanks for your help and all clear. We we'll see you for the signal on the right, please. Uh, Roger, two good starts, all clear signals, see yeah. you on the right. So this is all about the hydraulic panel video. I hope you like this video. Thanks you guys, thanks for watching.